hello everyone welcome back to another session so in this session i am going to uh, discuss about the asset classes in sap asset accounting module so first of all i will brief about the asset class and then how to then we'll see how to create the asset classes in sap okay so generally this asset class is a group of similar number of assets which control the gl posting related to asset management and it also controls the screen layout and number ranges uh, for the asset master data. Okay, so when you say asset classes, uh, it means uh, assets which have common characteristics like uh, same useful life or same method of depreciation and uh, it will use the same GL, GLs for account postings and uh, same asset classes and uh, it's a group of uh, assets which have same common characteristics we can say in the simple way so let's uh, see the configuration now so just access the spro path and then sap reference img and here go to financial accounting and then asset accounting and then expand this organization structure and here asset class so before creating the asset classes uh, we, we should have to complete these three things specify account determination and create a screen layout rules and define number ranges so in our previous class we have uh, discussed about the screen layout rules now we will see this specify account determination just click on execute here so based on our uh, a requirement we need to create the account determinations first so this will be assigned to the asset class and uh, in the asset class we will be having our uh, assets so let me create uh, the account determination first so for this my building and mission and equipment and vehicles and then furniture and fittings and EAUC Okay, just click on copy. So here Z001 will be my buildings and Z002 will be my machinery and equipment and Z003 will be vehicles and Z004 will be uh, furniture. And then I need one more thing, Z999, so that AUC asset and click on save. come all the way down here so here uh, these are my asset account determinations so now i will create the already we have uh, my screen layout has been already created so i will just show you one more again once more just come down here all the way down so here you can see the buildings and plant and machinery and furniture and vehicles and uh, AUC assets so now go back and define the number range intervals for the asset master so here uh, we need to define the number ranging so that uh, we will be assigning this number range in asset classes so whenever we are using that asset class and uh, creating the asset master data so system will use that number range so here i am entering my company code as 2000 and click on uh, intervals so here i am selecting the number range as 01 and selecting the number range 100 to 1999 and hit enter and then if you want uh, if you want a different different number ranges you can also maintain like that so let me create 02 03 and 04 and 09 So okay, so two in the two I will mention copy this two 
So these are my number ranges. So I will be assigning different different number ranges for each asset class. So just click on save here and go one step back here. So now here in the third fourth step we need to define the asset classes. So before creating the asset class we must have created these three steps. This three step configuration should be completed before coming to this asset define asset classes. Okay, then click on execute here. So here you can see the transaction code is OA OA. So if you want, uh, okay. If you want, we can copy the existing uh, asset classes and we can create a new or else we can, if you want, we can also create a new thing. So I will show you here the new one. So the asset class, first of all, we need to select the asset class. Sorry, we need to create the asset class. So in my case, I will be creating Z001. This is for buildings. Basically. And here we have already created the account determination. We need to select that account determination. Come all the way down. So this is my Z001 building. And here we have also already created the screen layout rules. Just F4 and select your screen layout rule Z001 here and then here we have already in the previous step we have seen uh, how to create the number range and uh, I'm going to select the number range as well okay no not this one control F click enter your company code and hit enter then here you can see uh, again as to my company code I have created a 01 Zero two. Okay. Okay, I will be selecting zero one here. Okay, yeah, this one. But two thousand uh, company code two thousand. You can see zero one zero two zero three zero four zero nine. So uh, now I am selecting zero one for my buildings, and then inventory data include asset. So if we give the check mark, it will be calculated. It will be shown in the inventory report report list uh, reports uh, the asset will be shown so here uh, status of AUC no AUC or uh, summary management of AUC okay if the the asset is relating to AUC asset under construction then only we need to select line item settlement or investment measure based on this uh, setup you need to create a AUC settlement rule as well so we will be seeing this uh, topic in the soon okay and then historical status if you click on this manage historical status so whatever the all the history related uh, related to these assets you will able to see in the report and then click on save here in the same way we need to create uh, the asset classes for the remaining uh, remaining assets so now here uh, buildings is done now i will be selecting uh, machine and equipment and uh, okay vehicles and then furniture yeah here we have furniture and then i need to select the aoc okay Okay, I will select this one AUC. Just click on copy here and then change your name according to your requirement Z002. HSBC. And select the account determination which we have created. This is my account determination for machine and equipment and the screen layout as well. 
screen layout and the number range as well so I have created the number range as 0 to enter your company code and switch here and then double click here here you will see 0 to 0 to and uh, that's all and then hit enter and then for vehicles Z003 PC and then select here your account determination all the way down so from a vehicle Z003 and the same way I need to select the screen layout again uh, screen layout for the vehicles is Z004 and the number range would be 03 here and for the fini uh, furniture Z0004 select the icon determination for the furniture and screen layout for the furniture again okay. Zero zero three, and uh, this is zero four only number range, and then hit enter, and then coming to AUC, for the AUC set zero zero nine, selecting the asset class. And then here my account determination would be Z009, Z999. And the screen layout again Z99. And my number range would be 09. And then here we need to select the status as line item settlement. And then hit enter. And then click on save. So these are my, uh, one second. So these are my asset classes uh, for the asset accounting module. So, so first of all, we need to create the account determination and then we need to create the screen layout and then we need to create the number range and then in finally we need to uh, assign these all things in the asset class creation in transaction code OA OA. So that's all in this session. I hope uh, you have a uh, clear understanding about the asset classes, what is asset class and how to create this. Thank you so much.